Welcome to our channel. Today, we're diving into a critical health topic that affects millions of people worldwide severe stomach issues. You know, that persistent discomfort or pain in your abdomen? It's not something to ignore. If left untreated, these problems can spiral into a range of serious health complications that can significantly impact your quality of life. We're not just talking about a little indigestion here. Think long-term issues like ulcers, bleeding, and even an increased risk of cancer. These are serious conditions that require attention and care, but the good news is, early detection and treatment can make a world of difference. That's why we're here today, to break down these hidden dangers, empower you with knowledge, and encourage you to prioritize your gut health. Let's get started. Let's talk about stomach ulcers, painful sores that develop in the lining of your stomach. Imagine your stomach like a smooth balloon. An ulcer is a small crater forming on that surface. That's what's happening inside your stomach. What causes these ulcers? One common culprit is H. pylori bacteria. It burrows into the stomach lining, weakening defenses. Over-the-counter pain relievers like ibuprofen and aspirin can also irritate the stomach lining. Long-term use makes it vulnerable to ulcers. Ignoring ulcers can escalate quickly. Intense burning pain, especially on an empty stomach. You'll know it when you feel it. Untreated ulcers can lead to gastrointestinal bleeding. This requires immediate medical attention. Severe cases can perforate, creating a hole in the stomach wall. This is a life-threatening emergency. The good news? Stomach ulcers are treatable. A test can detect H. pylori and antibiotics can eliminate the infection. Lifestyle changes can prevent ulcers from forming. Your stomach works hard for you. Pay attention to its signals and take care of any issues early. We're diving into a serious condition that can often go unnoticed until it becomes a major health concern gastrointestinal bleeding. Now, this isn't just a little cut on your finger. We're talking about bleeding that occurs anywhere along your digestive tract, from your esophagus all the way down to your rectum. And here's the thing, it can be sneaky. Sometimes you might not even see visible blood in your stool, a condition known as occult bleeding. It's like a hidden leak that can slowly drain your body's iron stores over time. So what causes this internal bleeding? Well, it can stem from a variety of factors, including those pesky ulcers we discussed earlier, inflammation in the digestive tract, and even certain medications like blood thinners. Now, if you're experiencing symptoms like persistent fatigue, weakness, shortness of breath, or pale skin, it's crucial to see a doctor right away. These could be signs of iron deficiency anemia, a condition that often accompanies chronic gastrointestinal bleeding. Think of your red blood cells like tiny delivery trucks, carrying oxygen throughout your body. When you're low on iron, your body struggles to produce enough of these trucks, leading to fatigue and weakness as your organs are deprived of the oxygen they need to function properly. Early detection is key when it comes to gastrointestinal bleeding. Your doctor can perform tests, such as a colonoscopy or endoscopy, to pinpoint the source of the bleeding and recommend the most effective treatment. Remember, Ignoring the warning signs can lead to serious complications, including a dangerous drop in blood pressure and even organ damage if the bleeding is severe and left untreated. Imagine a traffic jam, but instead of cars, it's food and fluids stuck in your intestines. That's essentially what happens with an intestinal obstruction, a serious condition that requires immediate medical attention. Now picture your intestines as a highway system responsible for transporting food and fluids throughout your body. When an obstruction occurs, it's like a roadblock on that highway, preventing the smooth flow of traffic. These blockages can be caused by a number of factors, including scar tissue from previous surgeries, hernias, tumors, or even inflammatory bowel diseases like Crohn's disease. So what happens when this intestinal traffic jam occurs? Well, you'll likely experience symptoms like severe abdominal pain, nausea, vomiting, bloating, and an inability to pass gas or stool. Think of it like this. The pressure builds up behind the blockage, leading to discomfort and those telltale symptoms. And if left untreated, the consequences can be dire. The blocked up portion of your intestine can become inflamed and swollen, potentially leading to a tear or rupture. Remember that balloon analogy we used earlier? Imagine the pressure becoming too much for the balloon to handle. This is a life-threatening situation that requires immediate surgery to repair the damage and prevent complications like sepsis, a severe infection that can spread throughout the body. 
The key is to recognize the warning signs early and seek medical attention promptly. Early diagnosis and treatment can significantly improve outcomes and prevent those potentially life-threatening complications. Chapter 4. Malnutrition – The Hidden Consequence of Stomach Issues We often think of malnutrition as a problem exclusive to developing countries, but the truth is, it can affect anyone, even those living in developed nations. And you know what plays a crucial role in preventing it? A healthy gut. Think of your digestive system as a sophisticated processing plant, breaking down the food you eat and absorbing essential nutrients that fuel your body. When your stomach isn't functioning properly, this intricate process gets disrupted, leading to malabsorption. Imagine eating a delicious, nutrient-rich meal, but your body can only absorb a fraction of those vital vitamins and minerals. Frustrating, right? That's the reality for many people struggling with untreated stomach issues. Conditions like celiac disease, Crohn's disease, and even chronic pancreatitis can interfere with your body's ability to extract and utilize those essential nutrients from food. Over time, this malabsorption takes a toll on your overall health. You might experience unexplained weight loss, fatigue, muscle weakness, and even impaired cognitive function. Think of it like running a car on fumes. Your body needs a constant supply of fuel to function optimally, and when it's not getting what it needs, everything from your energy levels to your brain power suffers. Early detection and management of underlying stomach issues are crucial to prevent malnutrition. Chapter 5. Stomach Cancer Risk – The Long-Term Threat Let's address the elephant in the room stomach cancer. While it's not the most pleasant topic, it's essential to understand the link between chronic stomach issues and an increased risk of developing this disease. Now, stomach cancer doesn't just appear out of nowhere. It's often the result of years of chronic inflammation and damage to the stomach lining. And guess what? Certain untreated stomach conditions can contribute to this ongoing damage. One such condition is chronic gastritis, a persistent inflammation of the stomach lining. It's like having a constant low-grade irritation in your stomach, which, over time, can lead to changes in the cells lining the stomach, increasing the risk of cancerous growth. Another risk factor is infection with H. pylori, that sneaky bacteria we talked about earlier. Remember how it can burrow into the stomach lining and weaken its defenses? While this chronic infection can also trigger inflammation and increase the likelihood of cellular changes that could lead to stomach cancer. Now, it's important to note that not everyone with chronic gastritis or H. pylori infection will develop stomach cancer. However, having these conditions significantly increases your risk compared to someone without them. Early detection and treatment of chronic stomach issues like gastritis and H. pylori infection are crucial in mitigating the risk of developing stomach cancer down the line. Chapter 6. Inflammatory Bowel Disease Complications, Crohn's and Colitis Let's delve into the world of inflammatory bowel diseases, specifically Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis. These chronic conditions cause inflammation in the digestive tract, leading to serious complications. Imagine your digestive system in a constant state of alert, mistakenly attacking itself. That's what happens with Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis. Crohn's can affect any part of the digestive tract, while ulcerative colitis affects the colon. Inflammation can lead to serious complications if untreated. One such complication is bowel obstruction. Another is the development of fistulas, abnormal connections between intestines or other organs. Ulcerative colitis carries a risk of toxic megacolon, a life-threatening emergency. Chapter 7. Severe Dehydration – The Domino Effect we often underestimate the importance of staying hydrated, but the truth is, our bodies depend on a delicate balance of fluids to function properly. And when that balance is thrown off, things can go downhill quickly, especially when dealing with severe stomach issues. Think of your body as a complex machine, with water acting as the essential lubricant that keeps everything running smoothly. When you're dehydrated, those gears start to grind, leading to a cascade of problems. Now, certain stomach issues, particularly those that cause prolonged diarrhea or vomiting, can lead to rapid fluid loss, putting you at risk for dehydration. Imagine a constant drain on your body's water reserves, faster than you can replenish them. That's the challenge with severe stomach bugs or chronic conditions like inflammatory bowel disease. 
As dehydration sets in, you might experience symptoms like fatigue, dizziness, headache, and muscle cramps. Your urine might become darker in color, and you might notice that you're not urinating as frequently. But here's where things get serious. Severe dehydration can disrupt your body's electrolyte balance. Electrolytes, like sodium and potassium, are essential minerals that play a vital role in nerve and muscle function, as well as maintaining blood pressure. When electrolyte levels are off kilter, it can lead to irregular heartbeats, seizures, and even coma in severe cases. Think of it like the electrical system short-circuiting in your body. It's a dangerous situation that requires immediate medical attention. Chapter 8. Infections. When your gut defense is down. Our gut is home to trillions of bacteria, both good and bad, that coexist in a delicate balance. This diverse community, known as the gut microbiome, plays a crucial role in digestion, immunity, and overall health. Think of it like a rainforest ecosystem within your digestive system, with a delicate balance of species keeping everything in check. Now, the lining of our gut acts as a barrier, preventing harmful bacteria from entering the bloodstream and wreaking havoc. But when stomach issues disrupt this delicate balance, it can weaken that barrier, leaving you vulnerable to infections. Imagine a breach in a fortress wall, allowing invaders to easily penetrate and cause damage. That's essentially what happens when your gut lining is compromised. Conditions like inflammatory bowel disease, ulcers, and even prolonged use of antibiotics can disrupt the balance of bacteria in your gut, allowing harmful bacteria to flourish and potentially leading to infections. These infections can manifest in various ways, from mild food poisoning to serious systemic infections that spread throughout the body. And if left untreated, they can lead to complications like sepsis, a life-threatening condition that occurs when the body's response to infection damages its own tissues and organs. Maintaining a healthy gut microbiome is crucial in preventing these infections. Thank you for watching. Remember, Addressing severe stomach issues early can prevent these serious health complications and help you maintain overall well-being. If you're experiencing persistent or recurring stomach problems, don't hesitate to reach out to your doctor. Early detection and treatment are key to preventing those long-term consequences we discussed. Remember, your gut health is intricately connected to your overall health. If you found this video helpful, please like, share, and subscribe for more health tips and information. Stay healthy and take care.